Hello students, in this video I am going to give you some formulae to solve neat questions related to this cell cycle and cell division easily in very few seconds. Okay, let's take a question and then I will explain this formulae, how to use this formulae. Right, there is a question. A cell or a mitocyte which has undergone mitosis, a cell which undergoes mitosis is called as mitocyte. So, a cell by undergoing mitosis, by undergoing mitosis, mitosis has formed, mitosis has formed, has formed 32 cells finally, 32 cells. Okay, now for this, find the number of, for this, find the number of, number of mitotic divisions, number of mitotic divisions and then for the same question, find the number of mitotic spindle apparatus required for the formation of 32 cells and find the number of generations of mitosis that cell has undergone. Okay. So, to find the number of mitotic divisions for the formation of 32 cells, we have to use the formula n minus 1, where n equals to number of cells formed, total number of cells formed. Here n is nothing but 32. So, what we have to take? 32 minus 1. So, 31 cells. Well, sorry, 31 mitotic divisions. Okay. Uh, for the same question, we can also say that uh, these the number of cells which have undergone mitosis are 31. The number of cells which are formed after mitosis are 32 or the number of mitotic divisions which have occurred is 31 n minus 1 where n equals to number of cells formed. So that is 32. So n equals to number of cells formed. Next for the same question number of my mitotic spindle apparatus find the number of mitotic spindle apparatus required for the formation of 32 cells. How many mitotic spindle apparatus are required? 31. Because how many mitotic divisions have occurred? 31 mitotic divisions have occurred. For one mitotic division, how many spindle apparatus? 1. So, 31. N number. So, formula to be used is N. Where N equals to number of mitotic divisions. Here, N is nothing but number of mitotic divisions. Divisions, right. Okay, number of generations of mitosis. How many uh, number of, what is the number of generations of mitosis or mitotic divisions that cell has undergone? Okay, let's see. Now, this is a cell, one cell which has undergone mitosis and formed finally 32 cells. So, one cell forms two cells by undergoing one generation of mitosis. Next, two, these two cells undergo mitosis and form four daughter cells. 4 daughter cells become parent cells for the next generation of mitosis and form 8 daughter cells. These 8 daughter cells become parent cells for the next generation of mitosis and form 16. 16 become 32 by undergoing mitosis. So, how many generations? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 generations. So, number of generations what we can say 2 power n. We can use the formula 2 power n where n equals to number of generations. Here how many generations? 5 generations. If we use this formula, we can get total number of cells formed also. 2 power n is 2 power 5. So 2 power 5 becomes 32 again. 32. So total number of cells where n equals to number of generations. Number of cells formed are 32. Right. So here how many cells have undergone mitosis? How many mitotic divisions have occurred? We studied already n minus 1. We have taken the formula n minus 1. Number of mitotic divisions that have occurred, um, that has occurred is uh, n minus 1. So why n minus 1? Uh, 31 cells. Why n minus 1? We are taking, I am going to uh, explain. So one cell undergoes one mitotic division. Now two cells undergo two mitotic divisions. Two daughter cells become two parent cells. So 1 plus 2. 4 cells undergo 4 mitotic divisions, 8 cells undergo 8 mitotic divisions, 16 cells undergo 16 mitotic divisions. Now add all these 3, all these uh, mitotic divisions. So 1 plus 2, 3, 3 plus 4, 7, 7 plus 8, 15, 15 plus 16, 31. Totally how many mitotic divisions have occurred? 31 mitotic divisions. So we can use this formula n minus 1. 
suppose uh, find the number of mitotic divisions uh, required for the formation of that have occurred for the formation of 100 cells means n minus 1 uh, answer will be 99 so this is uh, about uh, some questions related to mitosis some formulae which are used to solve the questions related to mitosis okay next i will be giving some questions uh, some formulae regarding meiosis